So I'm coming on today to discuss a problem, okay? I posted this on my Facebook fan page. I do have a Facebook fan page. I'll put the link down below. Please go and like it. Um, but I am having a problem with my edges. And I don't know. So, you know, my entire life I've, I've had really thin, weak edges. And... Um, you can see here, all in this area here, and all in this area here. And um, <clears throat> I've noticed here, before I even did these twists, that here is not doing good. So, let me show you that. And then the same thing over here. Um, I don't know, you know, I, I'm so busy. I always care for my ends and taking care of my ends. And when I have like conditioner or oil left over, I'll do like this and I'll rub here, here, and like right here, but I never focus here and the back is fine. I don't have any problems going on in the back. No, it's just here. So I don't know, you know, um, about a year or so ago, over a year ago, I had a set of kinky twists and they did a number on my edges. Oh my God. And they broke off really bad and it started to grow back. And now I see it's starting to break again. And um, <clears throat> I was talking to J Coke 7 this morning. And she said maybe I needed some protein, but the rest of my hair isn't breaking. It's just here. So I think, you know, I haven't been taking care of them and now I need to get focused and take care of that and my edges. So um, I've been using my Clothes by Nature Leave-In along with the Jamaican Black Castor Oil. And I put it on there every night and I tie my hair down. But, you know, what other tips do you guys have? I mean, it's not like a major big deal, but I don't like it. I don't like that. Especially when I'm wearing my hair back and up, it doesn't look good. I mean, this already... You know, it doesn't look good, but that's just, I've dealt with that my whole life, so whatever. But here, I don't like that at all. And what made me really start focusing on it is, um, I saw Who is Sugar's video, and she's having the exact same problem. And it's been a month now, and she's been taking care of her areas right here. She even named her areas, y'all. She's off the chain. <laughs> and I love her videos. Um, so, I don't know. I even have an oil, but I use this all the time. Uh, this is for itchy scalp, so I have like olive oil, jojoba, tea tree, and all different types of little oils and stuff in here. I need to make some more. And I put that on my scalp, put it especially around my edges, but I don't know. Here's why I need some advice and some tips from you guys. What do you think? Uh, so, yes, I'm in twist. They took me. I'm not going to tell you how long they took me because I don't want none of y'all making fun of me. So, whatever. <laughs> but they took me a long time. Um, and I'm going to keep them in for a long time too. And my hair is getting long and I, it's great, but it's also a pain because I keep my hair up all the time now because it's like past my shoulders and touching clothes and scarves and hats or in coats. I mean, not hats, but yeah, it's, it's craziness. Um, <clears throat> I got a tutorial. Someone asked me to do a tutorial on an updo. Um, I seriously, there is no rhyme or reason to my updos. I just put my hair up to where the ends are tucked in and it looks good and it stays. That's it. I have lots of videos on some updos and some pinup updos and stuff like that. That's really cute. But for an everyday look, here you go. Um, <clears throat> I just take my hair and I kind of, you know, just pull it back and then twist, finger comb in, get it all back. And then, let me turn around, I take the back and I make sure all my twists are up and I just start twisting my hair into a bun. Once I get all of that up into that bun and I see the front, I can deal with this, that looks good. Okay, 
Then these hairs that are sticking up, I just take them and tuck them in into this roll back here in the back. So all ends, hair, everything, twist are all tucked. Tuck, tuck, tuck. Then I kind of play with the front a little bit to get it to look kind of the way that I want, but that's basically just it. So see the side, back, and this side. Just a normal tuck. Once I get it tucked in and looking how I want it and make sure all my hair is very secure in here, I take bobby pins and it'll take me probably three to four. And I just slide them in to where the hair will stay. This one took me three, it looks like. And I love that. The less bobby pins for me, the better. They don't hurt. They're not causing me any problems. And I wear this style for a week. I'll take it down after about five days, re-moisturize my twists, and then um, pin it back up into something else. So seriously, no rhyme or reason to my updos. It's just to get my hair out of the way. And if you want, you can accessorize it with a flower or something like that. But with me and just working and stuff like that, sometimes I don't do all of that. Only when I'm getting ready to go somewhere. But it's pretty tucked in. And I just keep tucking and tucking and tucking away at twists until I make sure that they are secure in there. But it's not going anywhere. It'll stay. That's it. So... If you guys have any questions or anything, please leave them below. But I definitely need some advice about this, y'all. I don't know. All right. Later.